Well, duh. Let's make this simple. I don't care about the quartering. I don't care about Hirohei. Criticize them all you like. But I don't appreciate getting associated with that clickbaity, zero effort trash. So what exactly do you have to say about me? Niggas need to be nice to the industry people. Them being in the industry and making something you don't like is no excuse for you to be rude to them or absolutely shit on what they've worked on in an absolutely non-constructive manner. There is nothing wrong with criticizing a piece of media at all. Art is subjective and there can be objective problems with it and fundamental rules being broken. But that is not the same as trying to get under a creator's skin on social media and actively trying to get yourself blocked. Like y'all be like, oh, let me piss the creator off who is definitely already on edge from months of harassment and being lambasted acid for just making something and then you motherfuckers would be mean as hell and just flat out say hey what you made is garbage and you're a spineless soulless person for making this and you should feel bad for making it you dumb idiot and then when you catch the block you'll be like oh haha ha, what a weak individual who can't take criticism you should stay off the internet if you can't take the heat get out of the kitchen bitch can't take the heat you're the one stoking the fire you literally just said hey this is garbage why why wouldn't they block you like are you dense would you care to present any of my tweets you know, the ones where I apparently harass the creators? What's that? Those do not exist? In fact, I have never been in any kind of contact with the creators of High Guardian Spice? Well, why the hell am I being lumped in with this conversation then? Dishonesty? No! I am shocked and appalled. How could an intellectual titan such as yourself, with so many healthy and not at all insane takes, ever try to paint the people they disagree with in negative light by lying about them? Tut tut! As for the video in question, would you mind addressing any of my actual points? Playing them for the wider audience? So that they can form an informed opinion? No? Hmm... Now why would that be? Could it be perchance that you have never actually watched the video? But of course you didn't. If you had watched the video, you would have found out what the video is actually about. Not harassment, lamentation for the state of the industry and all the voices not being heard. I have never in my life harassed anyone. Not even in the sense as these overly brittle little babies define it in our modern era. Meanwhile, you represent me dishonestly outright lie about me and my content. You do not know anything about me, my views, my values, my ideals. Do your research next time, you disingenuous fuckwit. And just so you know, you are not the arbiter of how people deliver their criticism, nor how much anyone is allowed to levy criticism to any given product. I do my videos however I please, and on any topic I please. Me doing a series of videos on my channel where anyone can either choose to click or not click on them cannot be construed as targeted harassment in any way. Besides, anyone who has actually seen one of my videos can tell that my approach to critiquing is equal parts comedic roasting and intellectual musing in nature. But of course, you aren't interested in the truth. And the comments aren't any better. Dumbasses crying about nothing, echoing this ridiculous strite. Oh, and would you look at that, you got some pretty big names vouching for your dishonesty. I'm not gonna lie. I disagree with a lot of stuff you say, so I clicked on this, waiting for you to mischaracterize me and everyone else. But you know what? I was wrong. There was a lot of nuance here. Good video. Learn the meaning of words before you use them. But then again... <laughs> you keep using the word. I don't think it means what you think it means. Thank you for making this. YouTube keeps suggesting these awful High Guardian Spice mock title videos to me and it's exhausting to see in my sidebar. I can't imagine how awful the creator feels. Oh no, woe is me. I get recommended videos with opinions I don't agree with. Feel sorry for me and the creators of this shitty cartoon.
soon? Hey, how about showing concern for the people getting actually slandered here? But hey, agenda is agenda, can't show fair treatment towards people you don't agree with. That's the way of the modern self-entitled creator. <sighs> so what's the takeaway here? Your average YouTuber is an idiot. Yeah, that sounds about right. Anyway, that's all I got. Take care everyone, and I'll see you all in the next one.